we definitely have a different look about us this year um, with the new guys that we've added, but then also I think our returning players. And I think after last season and, and, and us as a group, as a staff and as a team, the players do not want to repeat that experience. And, and we've made a lot of changes very similar to Ray, they're trying to maintain where they are and take that next step up. We obviously want to be where they're at right now. And, and since I've been here, we have repeated and been to the tournament several times in a row. And, you know, we want to get back to doing that. It's been a couple of years since we've been in the NCAAs. I have absolutely no doubt in my mind this is a group that can definitely do that. We have 13 home games this year out of 20. Um, obviously, uh, we're in a new facility. Uh, we get to play in that. Actually, we get to train in it tonight for the first time. We actually haven't been out there. So we get to train there tonight under the lights and play our first home uh, game there tomorrow, which I know the kids are really excited about. Top to bottom, anybody in our conference could win it. And it was really that way last year. If you look at our results last year in the conference, numerous games that we lost by a goal, one that we tied. You know, we barely lost to West Virginia, who was by far the best team in the conference. So I'll be honest with you. I look at the group I have right now. I think this group could challenge to finish very, very high in the conference. And I'm very, very comfortable saying that from a team that finished tied, I don't know what we were, tied six, tied seventh last year. But this is a different team. Um, very, very excited about the possibilities for this group. We have a big senior group this year that, that I know wants to finish. You know, well they, they, this, group, this group of seniors went to the NCAAs as freshmen. Um, they haven't been the last couple of years, so I know uh, they're hungry to get back. Um, and I know that's been a big impetus from them in terms of what they want to get done this year. Playing under the lights is, is you, you just get jacked up when you play under the lights. I did when I played. Um, you can't explain it, but as an athlete, it's just exciting. Um, so I'm really, really excited for our kids to get to experience that for the first time ever for a Kansas program to play at home under lights. So that's going to be huge. I think it's going to help overall with our future. It's going to make us more excited to go out there and play under the lights and then just have a beautiful facility to go play on and be proud of and everything. Of course, they're going to be excited. I think, you know, um, not to give away what I'm going to tell them before the game, but this will be the only team that ever plays the first game at Rock Chalk Park. No other team will get to do that. So I think that's a huge, huge bonus for them and a huge honor, to be honest.